let's talk about what Ajaz Patel did at one KD Stadium, picking a ten for. What a magnificent achievement! This is one that you know we wouldn't probably relate to a match which the team lost. I mean, you know, a player picking a ten for and then the team losing. It's it's something that I don't believe is going to be broken in the years to come. But uh, it, it was something exceptional to watch, wasn't it? Yeah, I mean, it was like those, uh, you know, have you done school projects as a team? Where one yeah. person does all the work and the other <laughs> also takes it. <laughs> yeah, very good. <laughs> most definitely, most definitely it was yeah. like that. But I think we, you and I chatted uh, midweek about this particular feat of Ajaz Patel. And you know, we discussed about uh, what you felt as someone who has worked with him. Uh, from a coaching standpoint, and uh, what, what were your emotions like when you saw him pick that tenth wicket? Uh, just very, very happy for him. I guess you know, like there's so much hard work that's gone in, um, and and so much perseverance, um, so much grit over a period of time. Um, you know, to reference back that he's he was the le the leading wicket taker in the domestic competition for three years in a row um, before he made his debut for New Zealand. Um, you know, doesn't really play test cricket, unfortunately, in New Zealand with the composition of the side, the conditions, obviously. Um, but in the same breath, um, I think I've referenced this previously too, and in a couple of comments, you know, he's found ways to take wickets at domestic level. Um, and, and, you know, there's some decent players that are coming through the domestic se uh, setup when you think about how well New Zealand cricket's done across formats over the last couple of years. So, you know, he's, he's, he's improved as a bowler. I mean, you know, it's the third person in the history of our wonderful game um, to pick up all 10 wickets. And you still can't get the man of the match at the end of it, you know. So <laughs> it's, a, it's, it's a serious feat. Um, but I guess, you know, just really excited for him to, to go out there and, and, and show, you know, the caliber of bowler that he is. Um, and hopefully, uh, I've mentioned this the other day too, hopefully this is sort of um, you know, giving the New Zealand selectors something to think about, especially when we play over here. You know, he, he can fulfill a role. Yeah, it'll be a little bit of a different role, but it'll give him confidence. Um, you know, it'll give him some cohesion from a from an input point of view when we play in, in, in New Zealand. So when we go on tour and he becomes uh, the number one straight option, that he actually feels part of the side and, and feels like he's got a real role to play um, through being a member of that team consistently. Yeah. Yeah, but in a game uh, where we saw spider references as far as the camera was concerned, it was quite the homecoming for Ajaz Patel.